Uh, okay. Uh, oh, all right, so it's okay. Measure. Yeah. Measure one. Right at the beginning. Five. No. One. All right. Okay. Five. Two. And freaking it's out. It's like, how are we it's supposed to learn music for this character? We're not going to learn. It's, it's been in three th weeks we have this concert. How long have we been doing this? Like three years? Me four. It doesn't matter. This has been a waste. I know. And we scream. Well, you scream. And I, and we. I just. I, I wish Ethan Capella never, never existed. existed. Shiny new haircut of yours. What could go wrong? Thanks. <laughs> yeah, okay, so we'll give Should them like we five leave? minutes. Should we leave? No, no, it's. We'll give them like five minutes. Them meaning the entire group. Yes. That is not. Here in 15 minutes, I'm canceling the concert. Yeah, text me. Where's the group chat? Where's the board group chat? Where's Will and Grant? Okay, something is wrong. We need to go find these boys. Yeah, let's go okay. talk to them. Oh, that sounds like PV. They probably know what's going on. You're right. Good chat. Boys. Ithaca Pella? Who are you? Yeah. Why did you miss our rehearsal? What? what? We are in rehearsal, right? No, for our, our rehearsal. rehearsal. We're in rehearsal for Premium, premium blend. blend. You're not in Premium Blend, you're in Ithaca Pella. What's up? I have never heard yes. of Ithaca Pella. Ithaca Pella? Yeah. Uh, Ithaca Pella. Ithaca. Weird. Yeah, like, good luck. With okay, that. whatever this bit is, better end fast, and I'll see you in 30 seconds. Have a good day. Good luck with Ithaca Pella. You know, no cut. You know what? I, I'm tired. We need to see more emotion. Bam, what do you want from me? Bam. Bam. Bam Schlemmer, come on. What? How do you know my middle name? My name's Will. Yes, you're Will S, just like he's Will S, and we've got the other Will S. I'm you're sorry, Will Schlemmer. 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 Yes. Two kings. Schlemmer. Okay, uh, I know Schlemmer. all of your names, Schlemmer. obviously. I know our names. Uh, okay, we're in the middle of something. Because we're in an a cappella group together. Can you guys Ithaca Pella? Listen, we don't know you. Okay, we wish you guys a little busy. We're sorry we blew up last night. Concert. Actually, Actually, I'm gonna cut you off first there. Yeah. We're, we're on a time crunch. Who are you? We don't even know who you guys are. The acapella? What's Ithacapella? <laughs> acapella? Acapella. Like, you make, you like, it's all with your voice. Right, like, yeah, it's perfect. Whatever. <laughs> Tommy, you can't beat that. Yeah, okay, that was. Okay, that, that's something really cool. is very yeah. Okay, okay. Please, okay, thank you guys. Oh, Excuse me, would you like to join a barbershop group? Alec and Patty? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's how it's saying, man. This is a nice trip. Oh my god. Whoa. Oh. Hey, um, hey, man. Who? You got, you're trying to start an a, a, a barbershop. Alec and Kathy? Yeah. Pretty cool name, right? Uh, I, yeah, but. What about Ithacapella? Ithacapella. Nah, that's stupid. Oh my god. Why are they all so mean? Is that Jamie? Bye bye. 
Is this why he misses 45 minutes of rehearsal a week? I guess. Oh my god. So this is the Whalen Center for Music, uh, one of the many homes for the School of Music, Theater, and Dance on campus. We have over 320 performances throughout the year. Uh, and if you do the math, that's more performances than academic days in the calendar. And yeah, we have too. a lot of non-major involvement. So if you don't want to major or minor in music, you can still be involved. Like our four acapella groups. We have Premium Blend, Voice Stream, Pitch Please, and Tone Cold. We have just about everything except for an all-male. I, I wish there, there was, was an all-male all identifying acapella, acapella group. group. I, I could, could join. join. I would totally choreograph for that. Please, President Cornish, you have to help us. Nobody remembers Ithaca Capella in our concerts today. We don't have anywhere else to go. We need you. Boys, boys, boys. Grant? Grant? Yeah. That's me. Now, what were you saying about uh, Ithaca Capella? The group you're in. The a cappella group. You sing with us. Joey, I think they made Grant the president of the college. Yeah. Why? Excuse you. Now, if you don't think, have anything else to say, you can leave my office. Oh my god. <laughs> What happened? None of the boys remember us. It's like, these are our best friends. They have been for years, and now it's gone. Nothing. I don't know what we should do. <coughs> Ghost Ben! Hey boys, it's Ghost Ben. I come bearing a message from beyond the graduation. You don't realize this yet? But when you wished Ithaca Pella never existed, that wish came true. This is a world where Ithaca Pella never existed. I think you know what needs to happen next. Tommy, I think this is a world where Ithaca Pella never existed. Isn't that what Ghost Ben literally just said? I think he was saying something like that, but I think I've really synergized it with yeah. one thought. And what's that? I know what we need to do. Bum. Sing. Yeah, me either. Bum. Bum.
of the wind, the slash of the rain. Go face them and fight them. Be savage, be savage again. Go hungry and cold like the wolves. Go hungry and cold like the wolves. Go away like the crane. Go away like the crane. Your hands will thicken, the skin on your cheek will tan. You'll grow ragged and weary. You'll grow ragged and swarthy. But you'll walk. But you'll walk. You'll seem pretty excited. That's great. <laughs> We're at the capella. There's going to be a ton of talking tonight. Joey and I are very old. So we're going to get right into the tunes with some Queen. Galileo, 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 Figaro. Oh, I'm just 
just a poor boy, nobody loves me. He's just a poor boy from a poor family, sparing his life from this monstrosity. Easy come, easy go, will you let me go? Bismillah, no, we will not let you go. Let him go. Bismillah, we will not let you go. Let him go. The Azebub has a devil put aside for me, for me. So you think you can love me and leave me to die? So, I'm going to kick off the senior speeches for tonight, and <laughs> the first speech is going to be for my lovely Joey. I've had the pleasure of knowing Joey for a year and a half, and while not, that may not seem like a while, I'm happy to call him my friend. I know I can be a pain in your butt sometimes, like being at rehearsals, please don't kill me. Uh, but I've always known you care about me being there and helping me become a better musician. Specifically, uh, two weeks ago at rehearsal, I remember you told me to make an adjustment to my breathing technique. And after I did that, you said that's the best tone you've heard from me, which not only made me happy, but asserted the fact that you were always looking out for us. Every single rehearsal, you find a different way to make us sound better, and I personally really appreciate everything you've done for the group, especially this year as music director. Thank you for a memorable two years and good luck in your future endeavors. All right. Well, now it's time to switch things up a bit. And this next speech is for Tommy. Tommy is one of the most eloquent and thoughtful people I have ever met. There isn't a person in the world that can sway a room with a few choice words like he can. He's been an awesome president, but more than that, he's been someone I could turn to for a genuine conversation as far back as when I joined. There was a moment when we were both at Purity, waiting for our ice cream, and we just started talking. It started small, but eventually we really opened up to each other, and that's when I knew. I knew you have a fire inside you, a tempered drive to improve not only the people around you, but yourself. To not let yourself be defined by things in your past, but to forge your own future. And I love that about you. I love you, Tommy, and I'm gonna miss you. All right, well, now you guys get to hear from the other Will S. about Joey again. <laughs> Joey. Over winter break, my mom, the legendary Jennifer Sherman, was... Yeah! She's watching the stream right now, so it's better be... Yeah. Anyway, my mom was going through some old videos from my high school, as, you know, moms do, and I could not physically stand to listen to myself in high school. It's, it's disgusting. It's gross. Anyway... The difference in how I sound now versus before I joined Acapella is truly night and day, and it really is thanks to you, Joey. You are a fantastic teacher. And you care so much about the music and our sound, and you're always pushing us to be better without fail or fear. You're a great leader, a great musician, and a great friend. It's hard to feel like this group would be complete without you, and I know I speak for everyone when I say we're going to miss you.
All right, I promise this is going to be the last one, then we'll get back to the music. Wait, where's Tommy? Tommy, come here. I've got more than one piece of paper in my pocket. Yeah, sorry about that. All right. I don't I don't know. This is from After Hours. <laughs> Hold up. Okay. Sorry, guys. Sorry, sorry. All right. If you don't know Tommy, you really wish that you did. Over the course of the three years I've had the pleasure of being in this group, I've learned how much of a down-to-earth, responsible, mature, and warm-hearted leader you are, Tommy. You're understanding, and you truly know how to treat others. As a friend and leader, you bring wisdom to any conversation or discrepancy that I have ever approached you with. You know how to make others feel better, you know right from wrong, and you see people for who they really are. I strive to be as understanding and warm-hearted as you are with everything that you do. This group would not be where it is without you, and you will be deeply missed. I love you, Tommy.
Everybody, uh, hope I'm Blake. I'm the social media manager. <laughs> hope you're all enjoying the show so far. If you are enjoying the show and you want to see more of us, you can follow us at Ithaca Pella on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, YouTube, Spotify, Apple Music, all the musics, all the Amazon, True. yeah, all those musics. Um, but another special announcement, also we're selling merch outside. Sorry, I feel like I should mention that. If you want to buy it, we're selling shirts. Um, but there's a very special thing we do in the Ah community at our at our at our special concerts. It's called it's called I think the Serenade Surprise. So if any one of you hasn't been here and don't know what that is, basically you buy uh, raffle tickets from us, and then we pick one uh, for someone to come up here and get serenaded during the second act. But we're throwing a bit of a twist on it this time. Say what? We're not just oh, doing, back. we're not just doing, if you win the raffle, you're not just getting the serenade, everyone does that. We're, you'll also be getting a signed Ithaca Pella poster signed by all the current members. But wait, but wait, but wait, we got a lot of posters, so we're not giving away just one poster, we're gonna give away three posters. Now, now, if you want to enter this raffle, everyone, everyone help me over here, you know the deal. It's one dollar for one ticket. It's five dollars for six tickets. And it's ten dollars for an arm's length of tickets. Look how, look how long my arm is. Um, so get your tallest friend and come meet us at intermission to buy some tickets, thanks. Hey, um, sorry, real quick. Uh, Henry Denton, would you like this percussion mic? Seven days of bitter, and my girlfriend went and cheated on me. She's a California dime, but I guess I gotta quit her. La la la, whatever. La la la, doesn't matter. La la la, oh well. La la la, we're going at it tonight. Tonight, there's a party on the rooftops of the world tonight. Tonight, and we're dancing on the edge of the Hollywood sign. I don't know if I'll make it, but watch out, good. Woke up with a strange tattoo. Not sure how I got it. Not a dollar in my pocket, and it kind of looks just like you. Mixed with Zach Galifianakis. <gasps> la la la, whatever. La la la, doesn't matter. La la la, oh well. La la la, we're going at it tonight. Tonight, there's a party on the rooftop, top of the world tonight. Tonight, and we're dancing on the edge of the Hollywood sign. I don't know if. Just don't stop in the key. 
Keep the beat pumped, keep the beat up, drop the beat down. It's my party, dance if I want to. We can get crazy, let it all out. Just don't stop, keep the beat pumped, keep the beat up, drop the beat down. It's my party, dance if I want to. We can get crazy, let it all out. It's you and me, and we're running this town. And it's me and you, and we're shaking the ground. And ain't nobody gonna tell us to go, cause this is our show. different reason though. Like to call like to call up Mr. Zeger to the stage. Tommy, for as long as I've known you these past nine months, I've always looked up to you. Or down. Because you're five six and I'm five ten. Anyways, on a more serious note, on a more serious note, Tommy was the first person to make me feel welcome in this group. From callbacks to sectionals to just talking about leadership. I truly cherish everything that you've said and taught me this past year. Other notable Tommy moments include how I became the social media manager or um, Tommy, I'm sorry, let me set the scene. In the first, first board meeting I ever attended, open invite, Tommy just like points at me and says, you know, Blake should be the social media manager. And thus is the story of how I became the social media manager. Um, and of course, hey, and he's been a great one too. Thanks. Seriously. <laughs> and of course, riding in Tom, always riding in Tommy Car. Speaking of Tommy Car, do you guys know that Tommy listens to just the audio of Iron Man in his car, like the entire movie, just the audio? Now, this important fact proves definitively that Tommy is the cool, sorry, um, oldest member of Ithaca Pella. <laughs> but in all seriousness, you've done so much for this group and for me. And I know that even as you leave this place and come directly back in the fall, you'll still be a great person, a great mentor, and one of my closest friends. Thanks for everything. Joey, Joey. Joey. Hi, Joey. For the first few months of college, I was scared of you. Uh, and by the first few months, probably up until mid-February. Um, it didn't help when, at the beginning of the year, you and Ben um, made me and Blake go for a run through the natural lands, which seems fine, but it was 10.30 at night. It was 10... Uh, <laughs> this is not hazing. Um, even though... <laughs> Even though you and I only made it a mile before walking, <laughs> uh, it became a great moment for you to recruit me into wanting a costume change in our ICCA set. You'll see later if that worked out. Um, at auditions, the board will remember that I whispered my entire audition um, and really would not be in this group if Joey hadn't forced everyone to give me a callback. Um, but what Joey doesn't know is that his confidence, I'm actually shaking, whoa, that his confidence in me has really sparked the first moments of my life where I've actually liked hearing the sound of my voice. Um, um, oh my God. Um, to many more random phone calls, um, trips to Applebee's and movie nights, and for Grant's sake, please not Paddington 2 again. Yes, no! <laughs> but um, I'm gonna miss you, I love you.
Hello? <laughs> Hi. Um, I'll get right into it. Um, it's the little things I'll miss the most. Um, collaborative crosswords in the car, both showing up to pub time in cardigans, laughing a little too loud in sectionals, or you quoting Shakespeare at the oddest times. You never fail to make me feel comfortable, to put a smile on my face. And these, these are the best gifts that you have to offer. Um, of those many gifts, the fact that you're staying on South Hill for your master's next year is one of them. However, on a sour note, I, I know that this is borrowed time. Um, as you leave the group, I hope you take pride and comfort in the fact that each of us carry some little part of you with us. Your vision as a leader, your compassion, your musicianship, your sense of humor, your smile, or some shred of your beatboxing skills. <laughs> so, from all of us, thank you and much love. Mr. Albano. Albino. <laughs> Joey, I knew that one day I'd be standing on this stage singing my last song with you, but I never thought that day would come so fast. You've been such a big part of my life that saying goodbye doesn't sit well with me. I'm going to try and keep this short, because if I write any more, I will probably cry. And then I wrote in parentheses, if I'm not already crying. So I guess I'm doing pretty good. <laughs> You've been a mentor, mentor, a friend, and more importantly, a brother. Thank you for being there for me. You've always been so caring, and I appreciate you so much for that. I think I can speak for the rest of the group when I say, I hope you know you'll always have a home here. Can't trace this 
I was gonna ask how we're feeling, but I think I can tell. <laughs> Who bought Serenade tickets? So I actually have some really sad news to share. Um, like, um, our wonderful, amazing choreographer, Sophia Maiello, right here in the front row. Um, I actually have a quick question for you. Um, Sophia, where were you supposed to be tonight? Um, at the, at the <laughs> Olivia Rodrigo concert. Oh, and wait, where was it, Carly? Oh, I think this really cool place called Madison Square Garden. Oh my gosh. Um, so we felt really, really bad for Sophia. Um, so we actually have a little surprise for her. Uh, we brought Olivia and Rodrigo to Emerson Suites. I know, I know. I'm gonna go grab her, I'm gonna go grab her. Joey hit it. Two, three, four. Hey, hey. <laughs> Haven't from you in a couple of months, but I'm out right now and I'm all fucked up. You're calling my phone, you're all alone. I'm sensing some undertone. And I'm right here with all my friends. You're sending me your new address. I know we're done, I know we're through. But God, when I look at you, my brain goes up. Fuck it, it's fine. Yes, I know that he's fine. If the kids you be poor, he can I can only see him as a friend. Biggest lie I ever said. Oh, yes, I know that he's fine. If the kids you be poor, he can I can only see him as a friend. I just tripped and fell into it. it. Is bad. Now I'm getting in the car, racking all my plans. I know I should stop. But I can't, and I told my friend I want to sleep, but I never said where in the machine. So I pull up to your place on the second floor, and you're standing smiling at the picture of me. Much hotter, but I really can't remember when. My brain goes up. Fuck it, it's fine. Yes, I know that he's my ex, but can't two people reconnect? I only see him as a friend. The biggest lie I ever said. Yes, I know that he's my ex, but can't two people reconnect? I only see him as a friend. Tripped and fell into in his bed. bed. Yes, I know that he's my ex. Can't two people reconnect?
So, um, I have two speeches here. We're going to figure out which one's which. And it's this one. Great. Um, before we get into our next couple of tunes, uh, we would like to give a huge shout out to Amelia Ostavendi, who arranged the song you just heard. Big applause for Amelia. <laughs> All righty. Um, so, I misread the sheet, and it's Grant's turn to speak. Hey everybody. Um, well, I think you guys know what time it is. There's a chair on the stage. What could that possibly mean? You might be asking yourself. It's the time for the Serenade Surprise! Everybody get their tickets out! All right. So, so, oh, thank you. Come on, come on up, come on up. Yeah, yeah. So should we do the two posters first or the Serenade first? Posters and then serenade? All right. Yeah, pill the intensity. All right, so first ticket for one of the posters. Signed posters. Drum roll, please. <coughs> one, six, six, zero, zero, nine, two. Dakota, you're welcome. Enjoy that poster, my friend. Next ticket for another poster, guys. All right. The number is one, six, five, nine, five, five, one. All right, I'm gonna read it again. <laughs> Just in case you guys didn't hear me. One, six, five, nine, five, five, one. All right. <laughs> you. <laughs> Is it yours? All right, last one. But no, I'm just, just kidding, I'm uh, sorry guys. I've only done this, I don't know. One, six, five, nine, six, two, four. Are you kidding me? What is it? Is everybody ready? The next, the next ticket that gets pulled is gonna be sitting in this chair right here. I had to do that for dramatic effect. <laughs> that was awesome. All right, ready? 
The number is one, six, five, nine, five, nine, two. This is my brother Ben. We're gonna do like a serious competition set, and it's gonna be great. Okay, here we go. Um, I love you, Bill. <laughs> um, hey, everyone. We are very excited to share with our campus community our ICCA set. We had the absolute privilege of competing alongside both Premium Blend and Voice Stream for the first time in five years, I believe. It's pretty cool. Um, this set took us to semifinals along with Premium Blend. And we were very excited that we get to continue to support each other through the sets that we've crafted and through the arrangements that we send each other. Um, this set was put together to show how emotions can get the best of us sometimes. This concert is proving that. Um, it's all too easy to get overwhelmed these days. And when we blow up at each other, it can take some time to come back to Earth, to find our way back to ourselves. We're here to present a story of losing yourself to all different elements of emotion and how we can eventually recover ourselves we ask that you hold your applause to the end. And enough talking, let's do some choreography. Yeah.
Stressful waters to relieve 
regrets look just like texts I shouldn't send. I got neighbors and more like strangers we could be friends. I just need a way out of my head. I'll do anything for a way out of my head. Ooh, don't you know that the sunshine don't feel right when you're inside all day? I wish it were nice out, but it looked like rain. Gray skies are drifting, not living forever. again. I'm going to do that thing again where there are two speeches and I don't know which speech is the right speech, so it's not this one. <laughs> so uh, we've got a lot of thank yous to do here. Um, a lot of people make this happen. First, I want to start out with our incredible AV team. Can we give them a round of applause? Also, the folks in CES event planning, uh, Peter Alario and all of CES. <laughs> and all our friends at Campus Center. Our photographer, Kyle. Thank you. Um, our advisor, Dr. Baruch Whitehead. Zachary McDonald and the entire School of Music for letting us use their spaces and practice and supporting us. SGC and OSC for funding and supporting this op operation. Thank you so much. Uh, Brittany Watchers and Dan Rogers in particular from that office. Uh, Elaine Bettings, who has only been at this college a couple of weeks, but made sure those programs got into your seats, so thank you, Elaine. Our tabling folks, Noah and Riley from Pitch Please. And the folks at ICBS, Voice Stream, who handed out programs for us, thank you so much. Um, our live stream coordinator extraordinaire, Becca. From PB, none of this happens without the A community, and speaking of the A community, Thank you so much to Premium Blend. <laughs> and also thank you to Voice Stream. Yeah! A thank you to Pitch Please. Yeah! And don't go. Yeah! <laughs> uh, Sophia, Sophia, we're so sorry that we made you a page in the program, but you know that we love you so much. You do everything for this group, including finding me a shirt that I could wear 20 minutes before the show. Anyway. Um, <laughs> Our, our wonderful alumni for helping us start and keep 28 years of tradition. <laughs> How about that? All of our friends and family and every single one of you in those seats, thank you so much. Um, for this next song, We'll Be Here, uh, it's a new standard and some people in the audience uh, were able to sing it for the first time with us. So we'd like Ben and Christian to come up and sing with us. We'll let him take his winter coat off. 
We're gonna do We'll Be Here, our new standard, and then we're gonna wrap it up the way you know how with Coney Island Baby. <laughs> Hell yeah, thank you guys. who are familiar with Coney Island Bay? Get on up here! Come on!